I need you to be on your best behavior. Uh, I promised someone else I would be on my worst behavior. So, yeah, that's where we are. Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is still Tuesday, November 15th, 2022. I'm the drunk poker and you're not. Well, it's beer time, I guess. It's probably nicer. Nobody wants to be you. Craft beer is that shut up. Anyways, from our pals at Collective Arts, this one from Collective Arts Toronto, C A T O. Cato! Best behavior, IPA with nectar on hops and extract. So it's straight up nectar on hops, and then they did like a hop oil extract, which is supposed to enhance and in, invigorate the, the flavor and aromas for the nectar on hops. I know a little bit about nectar on hops. Nobody heard about it? Over here called Two Pad Stack. Uh, 7% ABV. Pick some up today, because that's what I did. Because they released two IPAs on the same day. Because they don't care. They're like, we're going to do it. You can't stop us. You can't stop us. We're going for world domination. <laughs> and really, at this point, are they not? Because they're everywhere, man. They're everywhere. CA is everywhere, and I love it. I love seeing other people drinking collective arts beers, like from other countries. And like, this is on tap. And I'm like, yeah, it's on tap? That's amazing. All right, let's get into it. Cheers, my friends. Uh, nectar on. Mm -hmm. Next to Ron, well, I guess I can sit next to Ron. Cheers. This is next to Ronnie. Like grape, peach, orange, mango. That's nice. Smooth. Weird. Weirdly smooth. Smooth. Textured. Smooth textured. Nice bit of pithy bitterness. Again, both of the IPAs we had today had sort of a very nice soft landing at the back end. Like pithy, but not like crazy bitter. Like just very, very accessible, nice, fruity, tropical IPAs. And that's kind of nice too. Like I do love my, you know, big hot bombs. We've had a lot of those lately too. A lot of them, a lot of big, like ridiculously over the top hot beers. And it's nice to just kind of settle back with, I would put this kind of mid, mid coast. Because it's not quite West Coast, definitely not East Coast, but it does fill in the middle with the juiciness and the tropicalness, but it's got a nice bit of bitterness to it, just nothing oh, excessive. Well, what Oreo said there. Does he ever look at me like I'm a cat? I don't think so. Sometimes. All right. Well, I hope you guys are having a good day. The nice thing is, I mean, if, if, you, if you do like a style of beer, Collective Arts has something for you. That's one of the things I do love about them. We can go down there and then depending on the mood that my lovely wife is in, Mrs. Polk, when she, when she, it depends, right? Because sometimes she's like, oh, I just want to drink like barrel aged beers. I'm like, okay, I'm all for that. And then sometimes it's just lagers. And I'm like, okay, I'm here for that too. Never IPAs, which I am also here for because then all the IPAs are belong to us. All your base are belong to us. <sighs> all right. Hope you guys are having a good day. I've rambled enough. Polk loves you. Take it easy. See you on the Wednesday. When, which is my Friday, so tonight's my Thursday, so, well, you know where that's going to end up. Cheers, my friends. See you tomorrow. Is a, is a good, is a good nectaron. Is a nectaron's a good hop. We like it. We like it a lot.